Okay, if we're working off uh, the tabs that I've sent you, we're looking at that one cool lick in November Rain by Guns N' Roses near the end of the first solo. So this is roughly like four and a half minutes into the song. Um, so we're looking at uh, trying to break down this lick, which uh, has got a lot of stuff happening in, in it, right? So we got this. That gigantic long thing. So in the tabs I have, I've broken down to four sections, basically. Section one goes like this, and I'm trying to keep my fingers in this convention where, um, you know, first finger on the 10th fret, second finger on the 12th fret, third finger on the 13th fret. And lots of hammer pulls here. Very slash thing to do. Lots of hammer pulls. So here we go. Hammer pull. So that little first lick. All right, again, you're picking everything except for the hammer pulls. All right, lick number two, right? We're still kind of anchoring our first finger on this 10th fret of the first string, and we're doing another hammer pull, right? Probably gonna do it with my first and second so that my third finger is free for this 13 I have to hit in a second. So hammer pull to the 13 and back to this 10 again. Right, so that's lick number two. So lick number one, lick number two together. Again, my first finger is going to sort of stay anchored on the on the uh, tenth fret of the first ring. All right, so there it is again. One more time. All right. Now let's go to line number two of my tabs. So line number two is gonna start off exactly the same way as line number one did, where we're gonna start on the 12th fret of the second string this time, and we're gonna line up our fingers the exact same way. First finger on the 10th fret, right? Second finger on the 12th fret, third finger on the 13th fret. And we're gonna do the exact same opening six notes, where we're gonna do 12, 13, right? Picking those notes, and then the hammer pull, right? And then back to the 10. You did that right in the first bar. Right, we're just doing it again right here. Okay. So that's the beginning of the second line, first bar. And then we got to stack these 12s. And I do it with my second finger, third finger, second finger. I just find it easier rather than trying to make one finger. But again, everyone does it differently. If you, if you prefer to do one finger kind of rolling across those frets, you can do that, or... Again, teach their own. That's uh, sort of how I do it. So that's the uh, first bar of line two. And then the next bar, this is where I actually gonna roll my finger. I'm gonna use my first finger to roll across this 10 to this 10. Right, so 10 to 10, and then to the 12 on that third string. Second string, third string, third string. Right? And then again, another hammer pull with a backward slide. Right? Right? So we got... Oops. Right? So, so far on line two, we have this. One more time. One more time. Again, breaking into little sections does help with the memorization. So, this whole lick together, right, most of it, of the first line is centered around the first string. And then the second line is centered around the second string. And ends on the third string, right? Put it all together, we got something that sounds like this. Let me do it slower. All right, one more time. A little bit more to speed. All right. Sort of what's going on there. So if I was to even play along with the song, let's see if we're able to do this. All right. 
right? So that's it at full speed. If I actually slowed that down to 75%, yeah, just do that. It might be easier to get those licks to kind of pop through. Here we go. Good luck with the practicing.